Hi everybody, this is Tiffany. I hope everyone's having a great day. I came on to give a prophetic message. So guys, this is this, the third dream that I had on the 12th. So this is the last message. So in this dream, I was in a workplace and I was with this girl and she didn't ask me to do anything. She just needed me to be there with her. So what happened was, I it was after hours. Everything was dark. It was a whole bunch of cubicles, but no one was there besides us. And in the dream, in my gut, it felt like... Um, I didn't want to be there so I'm looking around just making sure no one's coming uh, and so we wouldn't get caught so in the dream it was like we were sneaking in there and we were doing something we wasn't supposed to be doing so I'm holding the chair for her uh, she gets on the chair then she jumps on the table and then she pushes open it's not like a regular ceiling it was it's like um, if you know the workplace how it has those those slots that is movable so it's like she broke it open and then she put her hand in there and she's looking for something but she didn't even tell me she hid anything she just needed me to be there like a lookout person or someone just to be with her to do this stuff so um so it wasn't like a friend you know a friend like a ride or die the type of friends no it was like you were this is like a acquaintance someone you're familiar with someone you work with like just a regular co-worker that you're <laughs> there with so she, while she's doing that looking for something out of nowhere I fall the chair falls and then it's like the desk disappeared so then she's hanging with both hands and her feet are dangling um, <laughs> because <laughs> there's no way there for her to stand or get down and then that was the end of the dream so pretty much this is a preventative dream so this hasn't happened yet so someone is gonna come to you it could be in the workplace if that's where the focus was, but it, it could be anything in life. So always keep your eyes open, um, especially when you hear messages like that, because it doesn't have to specifically be that. It could be something else. Just pay attention to the Holy Spirit when you get alerted. So, but since the main uh, focus was a working environment, um, an office space, a whole bunch of cubicles, that's where we're going to focus, right? Um, so anyway, someone's going to come to you and ask for you to assist them to do something. It's going to be after hours and it's going to be illegal. So pretty much if you're having a gut feeling not to do something, don't do it. We didn't get caught in the dream. So Father God is letting us know that this is preventative. Someone comes to you and asks you to assist them um, to do something that you might get in trouble for and your gut is telling you not to do it, then don't do it. Um, so yeah, it's, this is pretty much it. it. It's just something that can be prevented. Because what's going to happen is you're going to get fired or you're going to go to jail. So you pray about everything. So it's not like this is a friend. This is someone that you don't even know what this is that the person hid. So it's like uh, you don't know. So it's like don't get involved. Um, because what's going to happen is it's it could because my gut was going off my a gut feeling an uneasy feeling. That's just letting you know it's not a good situation to be in. And then because it's after hours, you guys like breaking in to your workplace, then you might lose your job and then you might go to jail. So, you, you know, you, it's just things that can be prevented if we just take a second to think. Right. This was in a hardcore friendship. It was a, a co-worker. Um, yeah. So pretty much just keep your eyes peeled when someone asks you to do something that that's in your workplace one of your co-workers asking you to do something that you feel uneasy to do then this is the message for you um pray about it um but if your gut feeling is going off and someone wants you to break into your workplace after hours to get whatever it was then don't do it because you don't know what's going to happen you don't know what the outcome is going to be but yeah this message is definitely preventable so yeah so pray to father god about people places and things and just confirm if there's something that you should do but in this situation no <laughs> you know what i mean so that's it for the message, guys. I hope this message helps somebody. I love you guys. Have a wonderful and blessed day, and I'll see you soon. God willing, God bless. Bye.